Yay. Hey guys, welcome oh, back to Game oh. Fish. And uh, welcome back to Bloodborne. Yay. We're uh, in the middle of uh, Central Yarnum right now. Just got to the first lamp and uh, J Rose. Still playing. Hopefully, going to make it to the first boss in this episode. We'll see. What's his name? The Cleric Beast. The cleric Beast. His real name was Lawrence before he turned into a beast. Lawrence. Lawrence. He was not a very clever man either. Well, you know what wouldn't be very clever? What wouldn't? You handed me a lighter. That I can do, sir. I will always hand you a lighter here on Game Fish. If I have to. Let me go get one. Hold on. <laughs> Gotta get your lighter, buddy. Just get it. I'll be right back. Hold on. All right, man. Okay, here's the lighter, dude. Sorry about all that. Okay. The way we have things set up here is like knocking things over and all this nonsense. Where are you at? Oh, did you, like, just drop down the thing, or? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, dude. I was on fire for a second. Got your Molotov cocktail. Trot along, will ya? Those are useful, dude. Don't use don't use those on regular enemies. Okay, so this is the part of the game where, like I said, locking on becomes very important. When you're fighting multiple enemies, just like lock on to one of them here in a sec and just just play with the dodge mechanic a little bit. Because right. it's much better with the R3 lock on. You don't want to run straight up to those guys. Just a word of advice. Right, Turn around. Down. Don't, no, 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 don't do that either. Just turn around entirely. Yeah, see that guy? He was gonna get you. If I didn't tell you to get him. Lock on, buddy. Damn. He shot you. Remember to lock on immediately. But my axe can go full length, that's awesome. It can. Yeah, when you transform it, it becomes a two-hander. The Hunter Chief Emblem. You're gonna be getting that, that piece of shit soon. Well, not too soon, but... Bam, 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 bam. Wah, wah, wah. The Blade of Mercy. There's a guy through that window that you can talk to. He'll tell you some things about the game, but uh, it's mostly story related. You can't go through there yet. You've got to open that up. But once you do open it up, it's a shortcut to where the boss is. So that just goes to show you how close the boss is to where you're at. You don't have to go very far to get to it. Lock on. There you go. See? It helps you land your hits a little better, too. Yeah. <laughs> Cut him up. Nice. Okay, when you Dude, come to the bottom... Yeah, it is really addictive, isn't it? It gets very frustrating sometimes, too. Honestly, just run away from them. Just hold circle and run straight through here. Don't try and fight any of these guys. Just give them. Go immediately head right, right back there. Go up those stairs. And you could get that item up there. It's not super important. It's a bloodstone shard, which is kind of a good item, but... Yeah, just go ahead and keep poking it. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I was going to tell you about him. I just didn't have enough time to say it with my mouth. Which way? Um, stand in front of that gate over there. Well, they've caught up to you now. You can go down those steps, though, to your left. Sister, you can't get that. Yeah, you can drop down. But uh, running through there is what's difficult. You oh, can't open that. Fuck me. Fuck me, will you? You can kill that dog, though, and then run up those stairs if you're lucky. Nope. Yeah. Uh, you want to use the transformed version of the yeah. weapon for crowd control and the other version for, like, one-on-one -on -one encounters. 
if you had had your other version out, you would have been able to swing fast enough to take out that dog. A side question that has nothing to do with Bloodborne. Where the fuck is uh is Pursuit a TM? Can I get that, or is it a battle points thing that I have to spend battle points on? I think it's a battle resort. Okay. You can skip this area and just uh, to your immediate back right now. You can drop. Like if you, yeah, if you go through that, you can drop straight down, and that'll skip having to run past a couple of those guys. Cause you can fight these dudes, but ultimately there's no reason to do so unless you need souls or anything like that, or do you just want practice at the game, which is fine too. Oh, you almost had him. I would heal. Now, when you run up these steps this time, immediately head left, and then when you see that where that dude is about to jump out at you, just dodge roll, and he won't get you. No, don't go up there this time. You don't need to. Yeah, go straight. Dodge roll past him. Or you can just kill him. Yeah, kill him is even better. <laughs> Killing people is always better. When you stand... Okay, now, uh, like, like, face towards this direction, and just, like, look at it for a sec. Okay. See how that uh, fence is broken through over there? Yeah. Go stand in front of that broken fence. But keep an eye on that guy, too. But just stand in front of it for a sec. Okay, see how it made those dudes run up here? Now roll off of it and run directly across. Or I can just kill these guys. Yeah, you can kill them. I mean, it's up to you, man. I'm just I'm just telling you a quick way for the quickness. Just so you don't have to worry about getting deads or anything. You can switch who you're targeted ah. to with the right stick, like flicking it back and forth. Yeah. Beast roar, bitch. That's a cool weapon. Makes you go rawr with the beast. It's a rawr with the beast. Tool. Huh? You said it wasn't an illegal tool. Irreverent. What does that mean? Reverend, uh, okay, I know okay. Lacking reverence. <laughs> that guy was all like, Oh, I hate shit. Ugh. Don't do it. <laughs> Why? <laughs> For what reason is this? Well, well pitchfork well. guys give me some trouble. <laughs> There you go. Stupid pitchfork guy. Gotcha. Yeah, so what? Uh, yeah, you know, you fucked that dude up. Nice job. How can I get through there? I just, I, I, like I said, just stand in front of the thing, wait for them to run up the stairs, roll down, run straight across. Otherwise, you're just kind of screwed. I mean, you can fight oh, all those fuck guys, me. but it's just wait, like, run over here. No, <laughs> run over where? I mean, run where? Eh. You might as well fight your way out of that one. I'm dead. Okay, so you know where those fences break? Mm, if you I didn't see it. You, I mean, you have to see it this time. Because you've been there three times. You have to see you it. You absolutely have to see it. So the fences on the left side when you're walking on that area, 
is broken through. So, like, if you stand in front of them, three of those dudes will notice you, and they'll start running up the stairs. When you see them go up the stairs, roll down, and then run directly across, because there will be nobody to guard the side where the stairs are on the other side anymore. Then you just run up those stairs and run down the, like, that balcony area, and, uh... Avoid getting shot by the one guy that has a, has a mark on you, and uh, then you enter the next area. <sighs> Man, there should be piles of zigzagoons. I feel you. There should be piles of them all around me with like little X's for eyes. Like little swirls. Yeah, swirls. Swirlies. I'm a Pokemon bully, my friend. We're actually gonna make a Pokemon video soon. Shh. Shh. Don't Spoiled. tell them. <laughs> okay, so what do you mean? Okay, see how the steps are, or sorry, no, not steps. Look at that. See that right there? See how those are broken? Stand right in front of it. See the guys? They're going to run up the stairs as soon as they see you. Now roll down. But on the other side, over here. Yeah, there you go. Okay, now run straight. No, 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 no. no. Okay, that works. Run up the steps. There you go, now to your right. Keep going because that guy's gonna shoot at you. There you go, you made it. Yay! He still shot at you. <laughs> that guy wasn't letting you go. They won't chase you through here. There are two items in that area. Cool. Thanks, there's some buddy. blood piles right there, and there's some barrels over there. You can roll into those and they'll break. Zelda style, baby. <sighs> this next area is super easy. You're just gonna go down and then up the stairs across the fountain. There's some crows on the left side there. There's a big dude on the right side. You don't have to fight him. But if you want the item that's next to him, the one on the left is more useful because it's the torch. And the torch is good for illuminating air. You don't want to fight him on... Okay. <laughs> Have fun with that. If you're gonna fight him, you should be locked on. <laughs> if you absolutely must pick a fight with this dude. Uh, I believe in you, but I kinda don't. <laughs> I'm scared for you. Yeah, there you go, you're dead. Almost had him. I'm like, halfway. <laughs> Halfway. I bet I can get him next time. I mean, I'm sure you could. You could try again. I bet I can't try again. <laughs> the bastard of Lorne. A hamburger of curses and symbol of defilement. But like I said, there's literally no reason to kill them because the next time you die, they're all gonna come back anyway. The only reason you can kill them is for blood souls to become more powerful, and in order to progress. So if they're not standing in your way, you really don't have that much of a reason to take them out. But they all attack you. That's for shizzle. That was cool. Nice job. Now they know you're here. <laughs> Just a single shot. Pow! They're like, what Come the? Here. Oh, oh, there's a guy. Get him. Get him with our pitchforks and our other household weapons. Butcher knives. Etc. Did you hear that far? I didn't, but it, I'm sure if I had, it would have sounded like a growl. It did. Your farts usually sound like a large beast growling. dropped a little early but hey it worked out you get what I mean now you figured it out there's an item right there all right
Alright, nice job. You made it back here on the first try. Good stuff. Yeah. We'll have to next time on, on Game.